Yo, what's up guys? I have another free pick video for you today. We got Saturday NBA today and last night I ended up posting my men's final four video. So if you guys didn't see that, go ahead and watch that. I gave two picks for college uh, games today. So go ahead and watch that and then I'm going to get right into this video guys. First, we are on a 12-4 and four run, so please go ahead and subscribe and hit the notification bell as well so that you get notified when I post the videos because a lot of the times after I post the videos, the lines get bumped. And so if you guys hit the notification bell, you get notified right when I post the video so you don't miss out on the best lines because I post as soon as possible so you guys get the best possible lines. And also go ahead and drop a like. It is obviously completely free. It takes one second and just helps me out and the channel out a lot. So thank you guys so much. Um, I just wanted to make a quick video today, guys. Two picks. I'm just putting this up because when I was making my college video, I realized that I completely forgot to add in a little bit of NBA, which I like to do during the college videos. So I just said, whatever, I'm just going to make a whole nother video for you guys. Why not? Um, we're going to completely skip the first uh, game today with Lakers Cleveland because it's we're a couple hours from game time and I want to make sure you guys have time to watch this and get the plays in so we're just going to skip that game and then we're just going to get right into it guys the first pick we have is we're going to go with Joel Embiid we're going to go with Joel under three and a half turnovers so he's playing Memphis in this game. He's starting to get a little bit more playing time. But right now, since he's been back, the offense isn't really running through him, it seems like, as much as it usually does. It's running through, you know, Tyrese Maxey more. Um, and so since he's been back, he did have six against OKC. But he had one against Miami. And then when you guys look back at his game log, there was a stretch right before he got hurt. The stretch was like, he had like one, two, maybe three, and then like a one, two, 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 one, one. Like he's not getting close to this line. He's averaging right around three and a half turnovers this season, but he's playing Memphis. Not a great defense this season. This game should be maybe not a blowout, but it, sh it shouldn't be a close game, with a, and it has the possibility of being a blowout. So I think three and a half turnovers for jo Joel is too high. So we're going to take the under there. Um, that's just one play I was looking at earlier and I really liked. And then this play, I really like. So they have Claxton at 11 and a half rebounds and assists right now, which is insane. I thought for sure they would have already bumped this to at least 12, if not 12 and a half, because they have his rebounds at 10 right now. And then they only have this at 11 and a half. Usually he gets, you know, he could get one or two assists a game possibly three he's playing Detroit today horrible defense so I think he at least gets two and then if not three and then obviously he has the chance to have a you know a weird game where he has five or six but I think he at least gets two or three today and makes it you know worth going with 11 and a half as long as he gets two then it was worth going with 11 and a half versus just his straight rebounds line but he's been super consistent if I show you guys just the rebounds alone Super consistent, 13, 13, 11, 13. He obviously did have that six against the Lakers. But other than that, all season, he's been super consistent, just banging out games right around nine or 10 all season. Like one of the most consistent rebounders I've seen. He never really has games where he has 15 plus, but he barely has games where it's, you know, five or less or something like that. So very consistent rebounder. So I like that. And then, like I said, since Detroit is such a bad defense, I love that the that this is only bumped by one and a half. I think he easily gets two assists and makes that worth going 11 and a half. And then that just gives us really, really good odds that he does go over. So these are the picks right here, guys. But I do want to mention um, everyone that's been hating on the 12 and four run lately. We have all been moving to sleeper. The reason being is because there's four reasons. Prize picks, number one. And guys, you got to listen to this because this is this is super important. Like what app you bet on is very, very important. So there's four reasons why Sleeper is better than prize picks, and I'll give it right now. The first reason is they post their plays way earlier than prize picks. Prize picks, a lot of the times, even a couple hours before game time, they still don't have their picks up, and it's super, super annoying. And then the second reason is that Sleeper has way better lines than prize picks. So like I was just showing you guys, there was a couple other plays. I wanted to go Dennis Schroeder assists. But on prize picks, it's at seven. On sleeper, it's at six and a half. 
So Sleeper always has better lines than prize picks. They put them up sooner than prize picks. And then the third reason is they give you guys this um, $500 deposit match, which every other app only gives a $100 deposit match. Sleeper gives $500, which means if you guys put down $500, you get the deposit match to bump it to $1,000. You guys just have to at least break even with that money, and you could pull out you know, the $500 and make a free $500. Because that is how I made my first couple thousand dollars betting, okay? I've done it on every app. It's so easy. It's by far the easiest way to make money. Go do that. You have to take advantage of that. It is the easiest way to make money, especially on a Saturday like this. I know a lot of you guys, you know, you finally got a day off work. You're chilling. You just want to watch some college or NBA uh, basketball games. Dude, go on Sleeper. Get that deposit match. You could start throwing down some more money, dude. It's way more fun to watch with that deposit match money because you're not even losing money. And then the fourth and final reason, and maybe the most important reason, is Sleeper throws down promos. It's insane. And everyone's been seeing it, but they even have a Zach Eady play for free today. His game is later, so I'm posting this a good, like eight hours before tip-off. So guys, go get Sleeper. I put a link in the description where you guys can download it even quicker. Download the app, just deposit, it, and make sure you use that code GHOST so they do give you that deposit match. And then this Zach ED play will pop up. So you get the free play, you get the deposit match money, and you guys could just have fun watching NBA in college. Um, I've been talking about this in the last couple of videos, so you guys can pause the video right here and read. But basically, it's just everyone saying how much better Sleeper is. Like, look, thanks for putting me on Sleeper. Way, way better than prize picks. Just subscribe plus use your code for Sleeper. Won 700 bucks on Sleeper. So, guys, if you're betting today, if you're betting, if you like betting in general, get on Sleeper. You guys are going to make more money overall on Sleeper. So go get on Sleeper. Like I said, link in the description. Um, but, yeah, these are the picks for today. Under three and a half turnovers for Joel Embiid, and then over 11 and a half rebounds and assists assist for Claxton. I just wanted to get this video out for you guys real quick video. Um, didn't want to go too deep into the plays or anything like that. I just wanted to get it out for you guys because I did forget to put it in my college video. Um, but other than that, guys, please, like I said, or like the video. It helps me out a lot. Also, comment if you guys like these plays, if you like the college basketball plays, or if you've just been hitting on this 12 and 4 run that we're on. It's insane. And then, guys, please please subscribe join the family we've been building a family and a community dude everyone rides these plays i put down and then they make money and then they tell me about it in the comments and it's awesome to see so thank you so much guys for the love and support lately we also hit 2500 subscribers the other day so thank you guys so much for that um i really do appreciate it but other than that guys those are the plays for the nba today good luck with all your bets and i'll catch you in the next video